press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update. Hello, welcome to Asia Business Report. I'm Sharon G. Mail. Now, India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi is in Washington for his first meeting with President Donald Trump. India US trade ties have grown substantially, but with rising protectionism and a crackdown on visas for Indians, it's harder for Indian companies to export their services as well as goods. Shilpa Khanan has more from Delhi. <laughs> Hoping to get American attention one stitch at a time. These products are headed to the US, one of the biggest markets for the garment export industry here. Some businesses fear that India is no longer a priority for Washington, but they hope Mr. Modi's visit will improve conditions. We want US to remove the non-tariff barriers or reduce them greatly. And we want to promote India as a, as a destination for US customers because we make better quality than China. And though we may be a little higher on pricing, but we can match the pricing in the near future. It's goods like this that are a cause for concern for Mr. Trump as he desperately tries to balance US trade. Last year, the United States ran a deficit of $24.3 billion with India. That number is too small, says New Delhi, to have an adverse effect on the U.S. economy. But the U.S. doesn't seem convinced. So the issue is likely to get a lot of attention during Mr. Modi's visit. It's not been an easy ride for American companies trying to make it big in India either. Some brands, including Ford and GE, have had successes here. But others like Apple and Walmart have struggled to access the market. I can be great product manufacturer. I can have the finest technology, but I need the consumer. So it will be silly for consumption company like, uh, country like the United States not to look at India, which is the largest consumption market, right? So Indians used to eat out once in two weeks. Now we eat out once in a week. We will come down to once in three days, right? Look at the multiplication this country is doing. Nowhere in the world. This fast food chain is one of the many American companies that still want a bite out of the Indian market. Carl's Jr., best known for its oversized burgers, is competing with others like Burger King, Wendy's and McDonald's. The competition hasn't deterred investors who are steaming ahead with expansion plans. India has a lot to offer American companies. Mr. Modi will be pitching to persuade Mr. Trump that there's plenty for Indian companies to offer the U.S. too. Shilpa Kanan, BBC News, Delhi. And in addition to Mr. Modi's visit to Washington, here's what...